Hey guys, I'm back with another video and today I will be fixing cranberry chicken and walnut salad and um, it's, it's a very easy dish to make. It's a healthy dish. Um, normally you would eat it like in the summertime, but <clears throat> I just felt like making this dish for you guys. Um, I hope you guys are doing fine today because I am. And we're going to start off with chicken breasts. I already cleaned them. I should have washed my hands. Sorry, guys. But I already cleaned them. And I already somewhat pre-cooked them. Not thoroughly. But I don't like my chicken to be in such form. I like for it to be cooked. And then... um a little glaze to it. So I'm going to um, start shredding my chicken or just tearing it up. Shucks. I'm going to do it all here. It'll be easier. I should have been cut this up. And it's just so you can, um, you can actually tear it, but it's so thick. I don't want to even waste my time doing all that. But yes, this is chicken breast. I had bought this from the farmer's market. I had already cleaned it, skinned it, and um, like I said, pre-washed it. And this is going to be the main course of the meal because it's a chicken salad with cranberries and walnuts. And it's really good. I had made it several times and it became a great um, dish. Other people liked it also. So if you guys would like to try it and you wanna follow the way I make it and use the ingredients I use, then I would highly recommend it because it is really tasty. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna brown it, like I said, and I'm also gonna season it. Guys, you know I always have a little something, something to sip on. And what I have in here today, I love raspberry. I like the taste of it. With this strawberry daiquiri, seagrams, um, and um, mango is at the bottom. You probably can't see it, but it's really tasty. Here we go. Okay, so I'm going to season my chicken. I have Italian seasoning. Ooh, this bowl. I have Italian seasoning, and you can eyeball it. Oh, I have lemon pepper. This sucker closed because it will open up. Then that got my stuff. Alrighty, that was lemon pepper. Then we have garlic. Get the onion powder and this garlic right here. And onion powder. You gotta put a lot of that. Pepper. Make sure this thing don't open up on me. And a little ginger. And that completes all my seasoning. I'm going to put a lot. And then I'm going to mix it together. Now, what I'm about to do is, yesterday, I had set an example. And then I turned around, and it all went left. I said you can mix butter, olive oil, concentrate, butter. It don't know that's quick. Well, that was the beginning of my woes yesterday because my stuff was on fire. So that's not gonna happen today. It would, and you know what? When my daughter was filming it, I was like, let it roll. Cause I want y'all to see me mess up. Cause it was so funny and that, that video, it, it just went away. Okay, so butter and my EVO.
And I got this dumb band-aid on because I cut myself. See, yeah, I know I can't use these. I've been done. Went to somebody's hospital. Okay. Let that melt a little bit. I'm going to put my chicken in here. Okay. Just let this cook. I'm going to put a little bit more easy on. And I'm going to cut my fire up a little bit so I can go on here and get toasty brown. Watch this cover. And this is bleach, you guys. Okay, I'm going to look at my chicken. Like I said, I just wanted to just get a little brown, like cooked. Because I don't like that taste. It tastes like chicken, like boiled chicken. It don't have a taste. I like to season it with the flavor. And I'm not going to put no more um, EVO or butter because, like I said, I wanted to get that glaze on it. So, and you, you'll see exactly like this. You'll see exactly what I'm talking about. But it's going to be much darker. Y'all know how it glazes. You know how it will go. See that? But I want it dark. A little darker. And not hard. Still tender. But a little bit more color to it. Okay. So, while that's cooking, I'm going to... See my bowl over here? I have a variety of... Um, vegetables that I want to use. So I have celery and I'm going to use like four stalks. Then I'm going to use lime. Then I have my onion and I have my scallions. And these are all the items that I have to use for let me roll this. Me and lime don't get along. They just be so hard. But I'm going to work this one this time. Okay, so I'm going to use, since I have four stalks, I'm going to use three scallions. So I'm going to start off by rinsing my celery. Celery. Turn my scallions. Stay in. Okay. I think I'm gonna need more than these. This don't look like it's gonna be good. I might have to use all of them. I normally use my scissors, but not today. I use all these. Yeah, but last night was wicked. I'm telling you, something was going on. My plant was just going by itself. I'm like, what the heck is going on? We didn't even make it through. I was so disgusted. I went to sleep. I was mad. I really was. Woke up, did all that work, and ain't have nothing. I sure did want to put a video up. So, 
Now, y'all, that knife, we weren't getting it. We weren't getting along, so I had to get the scissors out. I should have did that in the beginning, because that's what I was thinking about, getting my scissors. But now I have to actually use them. Excuse the Band-Aid. slice them, but I'm going to use the scissors on these too because that's just how I do it. I ain't got time to be playing with this. And that's around get caught, uh, cut. Like I said, I am not a professional, but I do know how to cook. And these tools, mm-mm. So I'm going to try to, um, Make two out of each of them. Because these uh, salary stalks are really thick. And then I don't want them big like that. It's really thick. Alrighty. So now I'm not going to cut this. These um, salary sticks with the knife, I'm gonna use my scissors. I like it better. Then you get an even cut, you you know, it just works out better like this. Then you can control the size that you want. If you don't want it too big, thick in your, uh, big in your salad. Okay, guys, about to check on the chicken. See what's going on in here. I'm gonna cut it up a little bit more. And I'm gonna leave the top off so it won't make no steam, no juice. So that's exactly what it just did. Okay, so while we're waiting for that to get brown, I'm going to cut my onion up. And what's in here in this bowl is celery and scallions. That's it. There's not much you have to add to this salad. But the chicken is the main thing. And like I said, it's really good. All right. Okay, so now. Cutting up the onion. And they are gonna be in little small size, not bite sizes, just small. I don't need a lot. Say this for last. Okay, so now I'm going to go to my pot, which I left the top off. And now I'm at my pot. I had left, left the top off. So it can go ahead and get some ground to it. And guys, I will be back in a few minutes. Hey, you guys, we're back. And I had just got through starting my chicken. See how I done shredded up? And see how I done got brown? With a little crisp to it. That's the way I like it. So 
So I'm gonna have to let it cool down because I have to add Miracle Whip and I don't want it to cook. So you guys, I will be back in a few minutes. All right, you kill me. <laughs> <laughs> We're back, guys, and my chicken. Explain why you dress different. Oh, okay. Um, we're back, guys, and I know you probably see me in another outfit. That's because I had got bleach on my dress, so I had to put on something real quick. So that's the reason why I have on another outfit. Okay, so the chicken had a chance to cool down. I didn't want to. And see how it looked. I showed you before we had left. But see how it look now? That's how I want it to look. Okay, and I'm going to transfer it into this bowl here. And I will be able to shred it some more. Like so. Just rip it up. If you prefer um, chunky um, chunks in your salad, you know, you can have some chunky, you can have some, you know, really finely um, cut. Like I tell you guys, I touch all my food. I don't discriminate at all. And see these, still a lot of big chunks in the air. Okay, so now what I'm about to do is I'm about to season my chicken with bell seasoning. I had already seasoned it um, when I had put it on the stove and to um, let it cook. So, okay, so now I'm going to add a little dill weed. Go on my salad. Uh, you can eyeball it. Okay, and that's enough. Okay, so now what I'm about to do is I have Crazy's Dry Cranberries by Ocean Spray. Okay, I, I ain't got a lot of that, and we don't need a lot, even though they're good. And then I'm going to add the walnuts. Guys, what I have is some chopped walnuts. Pour all these in there. <laughs> You don't let me you don't let them see you pour it in. You they ain't got they ain't got you're so all that. Okay. okay, I'm about to put the um onions and we great art girl. <laughs> I'm about to put the onions, the scallions, and the celery in here. I'm squeezing some lime juice in here. More lime juice. Man, man. And then I have some mustard. I'm going to put some mustard in here. I say about a tablespoon of mustard. And then for the last ingredient, it will be the miracle whip. Oh. Another thing. Okay, excuse me. You guys, this is the sugar that I was telling you about, raw sugar. This is really some really good sugar. It's better than white sugar. It don't take much. It's the purest, this is cane sugar. And it's not white sugar either. It's raw and you add a little bit. And then you add the pickle whip. Then I'll just stir and add as I go. So all together, what you have is you have glazed chicken breast with celery, um, scallions, onions, um, cranberry, and walnuts. And I added a little dill seed, dill weed with it. 
to it rather. And oh, lime. And that's it. And you have to mix and combine this really well. And you do have to taste because you wanted to have a tangy, but also kind of sweet taste. But the miracle will once it um sit and saturate and it makes it own, makes its own juices, then that's the best you're gonna get. Okay, so need more. I don't like mine's dry at all. I hate when miracle will get off. So now I added more Miracle Whip because it's really dry. And you got to find your consistency. Some people might like theirs dry. And some people may, may like theirs with a little bit more juice. And a little bit more sweetness to it. I'm going to say it's good, but it is good. <laughs> it's good, but need more Miracle Whip. And probably a little bit more sugar. Okay, guys. This is the finishing of my salad. And I'm putting it in a bowl. y'all this is my salad with the cranberries the walnuts celery onions and a dill put it in here It's my cranberry chicken with walnuts salad. And I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you'll be the first one to receive message or notification of my, vi my video.